Hi everybody, I'm Sky Leopard, and this is actually my first video, so I'm really nervous. I hope you guys like it. So today I'm going to be doing a little bit of a drawing tutorial. It's just how to add a little bit of shading to your drawings and three doing 3D things like drawing cubes and spheres. So I really hope you guys like the video. Give it a big like, hit the bell button, subscribe to my channel, write in the comments down below, and let's get started. Okay, so this is my sketchbook. I'm just going to find a page that I can draw on right now. Let's do this one. So if you want to draw like a sphere, there's a lot of really simple ways you can draw a sphere. It's just really simple. You just draw a circle just like this. You can do this. You can do this. You can do even like the most simple things you can do is just doing that and then giving it like some kind of shadow on the ground. But another thing you can do is that you can do cubes so cubes are really simple for me so you just do this and then you just connect them all like that and that one didn't look as good as i was expecting it to do but that's fine but another really hard thing to do is try and draw a 3d star i've been working on this for a while it's been getting better. The only problem is that I'm absolutely terrible at drawing stars. So, yeah, I don't, I don't even know if this is how you do it. Definitely not. <laughs> Yeah, so I'm terrible at that. So I'm just going to erase that. But, um, yeah. And then another thing that you can do, which can help you be drawing, better at drawing people, is that if you ever want to get a YouTube channel and do drawing tutorials, um, a good thing to do to get lots of views is if you draw a person, just for example, draw any person how you want, and you can draw their hair in some sort of position, as if it's blowing in the wind. Like this here, it's not my best. But, yeah, something like that is a good way to get lots of views. And another thing is that if you give them, is if, um, like, you draw a person, like, from the side, just like this. So you can draw a circle, and then this is how you can draw them. I'm not an expert on it, but just like that. You can be pretty good at it, and then you can just draw it like that. It's pretty simple. That's not a very good drawing of it, but that's fine. And then another thing you can do, that's just like for starters, you can even just like work on getting a good head shape. Or even just figuring out what you want your character to wear, what you want your character to look like, what you think your character like wants to do if you want to make them holding something, or maybe like something in their hair, something like that. So whatever you want to do to maybe give your character a little bit of more p pizzazz, that's another thing. So... So yeah, that's, and, off by showing some of your and then, so it's almost the end of the video, so a couple drawings that I've done, so lots of their hair have been blowing in the wind, this is one of my favorites, um, I named her Summer, she, she likes the ocean, and she's 
in her early teens, I think. And she's one of, she's my favorite character I've drawn. So I really hope you guys can use any of this information to help to help draw better and draw um, more realistically. And that's all for today's video. So I really hope you enjoy this video and share, share it with your friends. Bye.